In this video, I will show you how to use the HT track to copy all your website to your local computer. And also, you can do the offline browsing. So, HT track has several versions. One is the Windows Win HT track, another is the Linux HT track, also Android HT track. So, one I use is the Window HT check in a window system. So how to get HT check? You go to here. HT check here. Go to the www.htcheck.com. You can download this one. This is the home page. This is the download page. Download page you can see here. Windows for HT check also Linux also Android you can download each one and you can download this one HT check is just the open source software you can download all everything in the local directory and also it's good things is the recursive or directories you get HTML or image or other files to serve to a local computer. So it's really a mirror site, it's really good. So how do we use HT check? So when you open HT check after download this one, it just is executable. Just run this HT check. This website copy, run this one. You download in, in the desktop, you just run this one. How to run this one? show here you can just click next so one important thing is, is space directory so remember I put the Google site is better to keep base paths the same each time for you update any website the reason is for example I download everything I have so many websites I download everything in the Google site put this space directory so under this one, I have so many websites I already downloaded. So it's easy to manage here. So I've downloaded this one. You can create a project name. You will, this is the web, new website. Never download the local. You can create a new project name. After create a new project, later after finish download, it will show here. The directory name, project name, is that the directory name will show here. You can also use the existing project. For example, this is my existing project. This one I already download and put here. So for detail, you can go to File, Browse Site. This Browse Site is the site you already download. So you can see here, I have a very list of the site I already copied to the local computer. So you can is is very good for index or all available project here. So for example, I click this one website. It's all accepted as online one, but it's just a middle one. So this is very good for management. So you create new one. You just use a download whole project. I find them now use the existing one. I will go click next. You can say next it will all default is the update existing download. It's because I already download. Even new one you just use the download websites but not existing. It even can keep the original website because you have memory of the, what the original website you already download. You keep it if you use the new website then you can just add URL, copy the new website here. Then after this one, you just click next and click finish. Then we start download. So I just quickly show you after what happened. You got after download. I click skip. You can skip this download. So after finish finish download you can see the website